Rahman Rahim, Assalatu Wassalam ala Rasulillah. In today's lesson, I would like to show you uh, a solution for a big problem in Advanced Steel uh, 2020. So, uh, as we know, Advanced Steel uh, add some new features in uh, Advanced Steel uh, or uh, Autodesic add some new features in Advanced Steel 2020. Uh, but hence we have some problem with this one. Uh, for example, when we can uh, we can uh, copy a joint for uh, we can uh, create one joint and after that copy it to the other joint with uh, only one click. But we have some problem with that. So now uh, for today I will I'd like to show you the fix or uh, a solution for uh, this problem. But before I start. Don't forget to uh, subscribe my, uh, my channel and share this video so as to be useful for everyone. Okay, first I want to uh, make a joint. Uh, okay, uh, for, uh, for here I, 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 use, I will use a shear plate. I select the first beam and the second beam. After that I will change the properties of the joint. Uh, as you see here from cut I want to from uh, flange. Uh, so to be cut with this one, as you see here, right? Uh, and for the beam, what I have, beam shape, it's straight. It doesn't matter for the bolt, maybe uh, 16. And for horizontal, I don't want to uh, be with blade. I want to be with the end uh, of the beam. I have uh, some uh, videos. The, that's why I'm uh, very quick here. Uh, after that, this one 20, I think is okay. Uh, 40, sorry, 40 by 40, and uh, this maybe uh, 60 is uh, good. After that, for the vertical bolts, I want to be in the middle, so this plate will be in the middle. And for the start, I want to 40 by 40, start and the end, and the middle distance maybe uh, 80 is okay. Okay. As you see, now I have uh, this joint. That's very good. Uh, as we know, in Advanced Steel uh, 2020, I can select Joint Box, right click, and Propagate uh, Joint. Propagate Joint, and it will copy this joint to the rest of the joints that has uh, the same properties. As you see, it copied every joint for everyone but sometimes for the corners or uh, for uh, some specified beams I have another connection so I don't want to copy this uh, joint to uh, this beam and this beam okay how can I fix this it's it's very easy but uh, why we, we make like this sometimes we have some 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 beam some beams and we don't want to transfer uh, this joint to uh, these joints, but it's the uh, difference. For example, ev everything, every joint now became one group. For example, I want to change this this beam because maybe I have uh, three rows of the bolts. How can I fix it? If I uh, select this one and uh, go to upgrade master and I fix this one, for example, it's uh, horizontal bolts. I make three ball, three uh, vertical columns for the row, as you see, and okay, like this. Everything changed. Every joints are changed. Okay, why uh, every joint change will change because every these joint became one row. So, what's the solution? Is the solution is very easy. Just uh, undo. So I want to uh, go by the first point before copying joints. Yes. As we said, we don't want to copy uh, to this beam and this beam. Okay. Select both of the beams and right click, go to isolate and hit objectives. Why we select this one? Because now when I select this one, <coughs> sorry. When I select this one, advanced steel, advanced steel, reads every beam exists in the view or in the model. Now, okay, it's, we don't have this beam and this beam. 
so it will copy this join to the existing uh, beams here yeah. so again right click propagate joint you see now uh, it will copy the joints for the uh, appeared beams after that right click isolate and object isolation as you see we have these two beams without any joints okay so I want to select uh, this joint or I want to co uh, copy this joint to that point and after that uh, I want to propagate again for the rest how can I do it it's pretty easy I can select this one or this one let's say let's uh, take the difference here as you see if we select this one sometimes it doesn't appear uh, the joint box so uh, I can I cannot uh, propagate this joint so I will delete this one and select this one by multiple create by uh, a template with multiple okay so uh, after you select this one go to select any uh, part of the joint space select the main beam space secondary beam space as you see now we have this joint okay we have this uh, joint box and i can now i can right click and joint uh, advanced joint properties i can change everything that i want uh, for example let's say horizontal balls we want three okay and the maybe this 50 is okay anyhow it's up to you uh, see now i change this one without changing uh, uh, the old one again click here right click, click propagate joint and it will copy this joint to the uh, remaining joints you see to the remaining joints or let's say to the remaining beams we have these four uh, joints exist and i think it's great and this is for the first time uh exists on net so please don't hesitate to share uh, to share this uh, video and subscribe the channel